uh, really, really, you know, growing USA and all these other countries. We're so glad to have Steve Labriola on the phone with us today, straight from Tillage Free Corporate. Come on to the line, Mr. Steve. Glad that to have you here with us today. Uh, can you hear me, Kelly? Okay. Yes, I can. Awesome. Well, welcome to everybody. I actually, uh, I'm going to hand this over quickly to, we have uh, both Carlos Wanzella and Jim Mel on here with us. So I'm going to let Carlos actually take the, take the baton for a minute and explain to everybody what is going on in Brazil so that everybody's more comfortable. And are you there, Carlos? Yeah, I'm here. Hey, hi, everybody. Hey, thank you very much for everybody joining this call. And uh, I will explain, I, I'm going to give a, a quick explanation what's going on in Brazil today. Okay, what happened uh, last, uh, before last night, okay, um, we saw on the news, after our company never received any uh, communication or anything by mail or anybody come to our company and tell us what's going on. But two days ago, we see on the internet, uh, one of the George, State George, uh, an eight, okay, we flew Brazil for any agent, you know, want to sign up in our company, okay? But today, it's nothing closed yet. I, I, like I said to you guys, uh, we're not received any notified by mail or anybody come to our company yet. But uh, our lawyers are not on the back stage, you know, to see what's going on. Okay, and I hope, um, I'm sure 99% we can fix this problem today and tomorrow, okay? But uh, one thing I want to make sure everybody understands, that's only one state, okay, it's Ake, they call Ake, okay, it's Georgia, it's the state Georgia, not federal Georgia. Okay, I don't know if they have a power, you know, to make a decision and, and close our company before, you know, uh, he in fact for our company. Okay, because uh, uh, they're not a federal uh, George and Zero Day State George. But anyway, we understand. Okay, I, we know we have some issue there, and um, our law is there right now to just to understand what's going on. Okay, and. and I hope we can make up the call. I can give you guys more updates, but that's all the updates I have so far. And one thing I want to let everybody know on this call, this is not going to affect U.S. or any other country. Okay, I hope it's not going to affect uh, all Brazil either, just one state. Okay, and I hope it's not going to affect anybody. Uh, I'm sure this is not going to affect, but it does not make sense. Okay, uh, company do very well for over here in Brazil. You know, we pay all our tax, we, 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 you know, we, our company is very good on the cash flow, you know, we can prove, okay, we sell a lot of our product, okay, and, and I hope, you know, they understand our business, you know, it's the way we got a new customer, the way we uh, put a new product up there, and I hope every, everything be okay in Brazil. But just again, I want to tell everybody be comfortable. It's not going to affect us and the U.S. and any other country besides this bill right now, okay? And uh, I hope they have good news. And again, our country is not shut down Brazil. That's uh, a lot of news there. It's liar. You know, for everything you hear from news, that's not, not, uh, it's not true, okay? Our company... Everything was okay, all our things are not closed, all things are okay in Brazil, and so far I not have any communication from the state. All right, thank you very much, Carlos. Um, actually, I want, Jim is here also, Jim would like to say a few words also, Jim Merrill. Hello, everybody, and, and I really appreciate everybody getting on this call, and we understand your concerns. We, we are always here to work on your behalf. Um, but what Carlos said is very, very true. We, whatever, you know, we, we feel like things will work itself out in Brazil, but in the U.S., it, it does not affect the U.S. market. And, uh, we're still growing like crazy thanks to your efforts, okay? Uh, inquiries like this are very common in network marketing. I believe in Brazil, uh, that there were, there's still some issue with Herbalife, Amway's had 
had its challenges here in the U.S. Um, we had such unbelievable growth that we're going to draw our attention. And we have some of the best legal minds on this in Brazil. Again, nothing will affect the U.S. Please continue your, your continued dedication. Uh, this company will per per persevere, okay? And again, thanks everybody for uh, being on this call. We will, uh, we're will we getting back to work now uh, on your behalf. Thanks again. And, uh, and I also, thank you. I, I, I wanted to uh, thank everybody for being on the call and also let you know that while while you're hearing all this news in Brazil, so that you all know, we have been here behind closed doors building to get to our next platform, which is just ahead of us. And we have not even, for an instant, slowed down that progress. We're still moving in that direction. So all of the media hype and all of the news hype that you're hearing coming out of Brazil, we will stay on top of it. We will find the right solution and we will keep moving forward. And we're still planning here to keep on rolling forward. And for all of you that know, I will be in the Fort Lauderdale meeting this Saturday, and I'm fired up as always because we're still going in the right direction. And as Jim said, these things happen to network marketing companies over and over again. And um, let's not hang our hat on it. Let's just keep looking forward. And thank you all for your dedication and your time, all your leaders that have been on top of this. And the news came out yesterday. I have to thank all of them for contacting me and finding out as much information as they can. And I wanted to put this call together for everybody to hear from corporate. And, and thank you for all the leaders that have been there, instrumental in maintaining communications. And um, we've got a great road ahead of us all. Let's not worry about it. Let's keep moving forward. And um, I thank you all again. And I hope everybody has an incredibly awesome day. And um, we'll see you all to talk. And I'll see a whole bunch of you in Orlando this week. I'm sorry, in Fort Lauderdale this weekend. Yes, I, Jim, I just want to put in a point quick here before you hang out. Uh, uh, just to uh, let everybody know, um, if some, someone has an issue with the second year or the binary, you know, I just heard about our company today from our TI side. I think they fixed the problem. If that's on the platform, just make sure everything's okay. By, by the end of this week, uh, not past next week, everybody's going to have the binaries right here in the back office, okay? Thank you for that update, Carlos. Great news, Carlos. Awesome. All right. Thank you very much, everybody. And we stay together. Well, our company is different, you know, for any other network like I never heard of this uh, happen, you know, any other network like like our company do it today. You know, we stay here. We're going to stay here for a long time. Thank you, everybody. Have an awesome day, everybody. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you.